Hey, this is Mikel. Early morning. <laughs> All right, this video is to show you how to reinvent yourself. That's exactly what I'm saying. You want to succeed, you want to make it, you know, in life. Well, then you got to start with yourself. And I'm going to I'm going to give you the steps. Okay? Some of them ain't going to be easy. I can guarantee you that. I went through them and I was like, man. But after, you know, after a while, you don't even think of them no more. You're like, whatever, you feel me? Nothing bothers you. Okay. First thing you got to do, you got to learn to be by yourself. Exactly. Now, now, now you're saying, okay, well, well, what does that mean? Okay, what that means is you got to learn how to entertain yourself. Okay, if you need someone or or, 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 or or something to entertain you, then you ain't there yet. Okay, because social for people, let me tell you what we do. We can sit down for an hour staring at nothing, but our mind is creating something. That's right. Have you seen the biggest geniuses in the world that we have had? Were always loner. Okay. They were always um, criticized by society. Albert Einstein was called mentally retarded when he was in school. Nikola Tesla was called a mad scientist. So there you go. And look what they did. They changed the world for the best. If not, we're still being uh, um, riding around in, in, in toilets and horses and using the toilets in our backyard. And I live in Alabama. Toilets are in the house. Just I've been asked that. I don't know why people always ask me that stupid question. But they don't. <laughs> but yeah. You got to learn that. That's number one. Okay. Now. Social media. Really. What benefits. Does social media. Bring you. How much time do you spend on social media in a day? Looking at video, you know, nonsense, funny pictures, and the complaints and whining of probably 80% of your friends that you have right now. They, you probably don't even know half of them. Exactly. You know, that's time that you can be using to read a book. Like Napoleon Hill, think, think and Grow Rich. Every millionaire and every billionaire in planet Earth, since that book came out, has read that book. Okay? Every law of attraction coach, manifester, has read that book. Everyone. Even, even people that are getting to their dreams right now has read that book. That, that book is very important. That book is knowledge for your brain. It's very important. You need it. Okay? So I'm going down the list of what I, I'm telling you what I have done. This is me. This is what I have done. Social media. You don't see me going on social media. When I go on social media, I go to my um, stock trading group. Okay? And it's called um, Money Star Traders. Yeah. <laughs> I forgot the name already. You see? That's how much time I spend on there because really I'm, I'm always watching new videos on YouTube about stocks and, and, and new stocks that are coming out and why they're there. And then I, I got to go do DD. I got to run it through my scanner. Then I got to run it through the analyzer and my investor observer. I got I got all these platforms, you know, then I go into different shot rooms that I'm in, see what they what they're talking about, everything. And I always turn off the bears, you know, the bears in the stock market. That's another thing. That's another thing that they, if you want to be social for in life, you have to cut off. And that is to turn off the bears, the nonsense. Okay. When you see someone posting in a, in a shot room over and over, it's a scam. The stock ain't going nowhere. All that. Let me tell you. Okay. What they trying to do 99% of the time is create fear so people will sell and, and the price will drop and then they will load up 
okay? So when the stock goes up, especially when it's close to um, earnings, you're going to see when the stock ha is doing amazingly, like P, uh, E, I, X, you know, they they are making some, they're, they're making record high in profits like never before. So, but the stock is starting to get attacked now. Now you got me talking. That's what happens when, when, when I start talking stocks, I can't stop. <laughs> that's what social for people do. You see, that's how my my subconscious mind's kicking in. Saying, Mikhail, oh, you say stocks? Oh, but buddy, look, da 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 da. Automatic. You feel me? You see, it's programmed in the right way. That's that's how I want your brain to be programmed. Okay. So, yeah, that's 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 what the bears do. They attack, and then they load up, and then before earnings, the stock takes off, and then ninety percent. When earnings hit and the stock is, the earnings are just out of this world, 90% of the time the stock goes to the, and then it just, they drop and then they load up again one or two days later and then the stock bypasses and sets new record high prices. You see, I just gave you amazing knowledge there. Okay, that's priceless for real. So another one, another discipline thing is this. Never try to compete or see yourself better than another person. That's against the universe code. That's against the code of life. I know, I know you're saying, I'm not getting spiritual with you. But there's one thing that every religion agrees on. What we think and what we believe from our hearts will manifest in our lives. That's right. Ask, believe, and you shall receive believe that you already have it in first person feel it that you already have what you want and let it go it's like you ever thought of somebody like um hey i i wonder what this person is doing i haven't seen them in years and then you just forgot about it and then they just contact you out of the blue and you're like wow i was just thinking about you well it's same thing placebo fed in the hospital sugar pill and then you get cured come on i'll tell you i'm telling you i'm, I'm giving you the knowledge you need in life Another thing, the 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 cuttering. In it. You see, I'm divorced. Okay, I would have never become a stock trader. I would have never been off psych medication. I was on psych medication from the time that I got married, and it was almost eleven years. You know, and I'm not pointing, blaming her, pointing all fingers at her. No, no, no. I take my fall. I take my fall. But only the strong survive and the weak walk away. You feel me? And sometimes the universe has to take away obstacles for amazing things to come. Sometimes you get a flat tire and, you, and then you stop at the gas station to get you a bottle of water and you play the lottery and boom, you win $100 million. You feel me? Something bad happens but then some, for something huge to come. That's how you got to see life. Something bad is happening right now. Saying this is just, this is just to make me stronger. So where I get where I'm getting, because over here, I live a different life than what's on the outside. This will become the outside. Your thoughts. Another thing. See, there's so many things I can go on talking and talking. You know, another thing is, you know, you got to stop looking for the approval of others. Sorry, I was just reading a message that I got from one of my trading platforms. Yeah, looking for the approval of all, of others. Do they approve of me? Do they What are you doing? What are you doing? If that's the case, then let me tell you something, you're going to be miserable for the rest of your life looking for the approval of others. You don't need that. And the most important thing is discipline. You have to be more disciplined than every person you meet that comes in your life. Disciplined. Okay? That temptation and temptation, you know, you're driving. Oh, man. But you want to lose weight. You want to get healthy. But now you see the drive-thrus 
and you're finding an excuse. Oh, well, because that's your old self con that's the old programming, your subconscious mind saying, Yo, feed me, man. What are you doing? That's the drive through. <laughs> Tell me I'm wrong. <laughs> you know? It will take time, but little by little you will get there. And then you you won't even let me tell you something. You will drive and you get hungry or anything, you know? The drive through won't even come into your vision because your subconscious mind is onto that. You get hungry, your subconscious mind automatic is saying, stop at the whole food, get you some organic um, snacks, chips, whatever, you know, sugar free, blah, 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 blah. Boom, your subconscious mind is already programmed. It's getting, it's letting you know what it wants. So you're not going to go to a drive thru and feed it something that doesn't want. It's that simple. I couldn't, let me tell you something. When I was married five years ago, almost five years ago, I couldn't drink coffee without sugar and creamer. I couldn't. I'd be like, I, I, I can't drink that stuff. Now, I can't drink coffee with sugar or creamer in it. I put it, I go, <laughs> sweet tea. It can be sweet. It has to be just tea. I can't. Because I reprogram my subconscious mind not to like it. How I did it? I start cutting down on the sugar and the creamer every day a little bit at a time. Within 30 days, I didn't even notice I was drinking straight black coffee. No sugar, no nothing. Just, just like that. You see? It's easy. It takes steps. Just got to have a strong mind. The will to do it. You can do anything in life. You just got to have the will to do it. You ain't got the will. Let me tell you something. You ain't going to get nowhere. Okay? So, you know, that's 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 part of, uh, of to see. Let me see. There's, there's so many things I can just, you know. And looking for material things to entertain you. You don't need that. You know, you don't. I put a movie on. Okay. This is how amazing my subconscious mind has been programmed. That I put a movie on. And I'll be watching the movie. But then I'll be on my phone. Doing DD on stocks i'll be looking on stocks i'll be reading about new news that just hit bitcoin or xrp but when the movie is over i can tell you exactly what happened in the movie and what the movie was for real because just me taking little peeks out of that beep, 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 beep. i'm reading i'm reading my subconscious mind Listening to everything, I can tell you exactly everything that happened in the movie, but I didn't even pay attention to the movie 90% of the time. Because on 90%, I put it on something else my future, my dreams, what I'm building. You feel me? You can do anything you want in life. I was worth over a million dollars five years ago. I lived in a golf community. I had the gorgeous wife, the kids, eat out of silver. My plates, 22 karat gold, Nexon plates. I can go on. I can I can tell you brands that you'd be like, what is that? Gold, gold, long jean, diamond watch, Rolex. And guess what? Did it make me happy? No. For the moment... I thought it was happiness. It brought it. And I was like, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. But just like a new car, you go buy it and it's, oh, it's my new car. No, I'm not going to eat in the car. Oh, oh, look, look, it's a little spot. After a month, you don't even notice that there's 20 spots in the car now. Dirt. Hey, well, you, I thought you wasn't going to eat in the car. What are you doing eating that burger in there? <laughs> Why is the wrapper on the floor? <laughs> it, 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 because it's all temporary, material things it's just it doesn't work like that really you know why i'm getting rich why i'm why i'm doing you know working my butt off going through everything i'm going right now after my divorce and my 
dealership that was a week away from opening everything. I lost all my money, everything, you know, things got hard. She walked away. You know, sometimes the universe does things to open the, the right doors for you to see that there is better. You feel me? Um, so the reason I'm, I'm doing all this, you know what I want to do? I just want to buy a car. I mean, maybe I get a Benz and I just want to drive, drive. I'm going, I'm going to take my phone and I'm going to shut my phone off and I'm going to put it in the glove compartment. Okay. And I'm going to buy me another phone and only, the only people that are going to have that phone is my kids. Nobody else. Nobody's going to have that lumber. And I just want to drive. I want to drive for around a year. I want to go to all the small towns that I want to go to. Make YouTube video. Trade stocks. And then. Just see where. Well, where, where I find where I feel comfortable living at and move there. I have a gift. I, I can read people. I'm real good in reading people. I can read energies. It's this gift that I have. But that's what I want to do. I just want to travel and just relax. Just, I don't want. I don't want to talk to nobody. Nobody at all. I don't care. Leave me alone. I'm on a one year vacation. I'm gonna take one year vacation by myself. That's what I'm going to do. And just trade stocks. Just you know. And then. I'm going to buy a, uh, probably some land, build a house. I'll probably get a house, get a warehouse. And I want to do cars. You see, I'm a mechanic. I want to buy cars at auctions. I want to fix the cars. I want to make YouTube video for my other, uh, I, don't, I don't even know what channel. I'm, yeah, I'm going to put this one on this channel. It's going to be for this channel. And um, make YouTube videos and just go to auctions and just have fun just make videos of me having fun trading stocks you know my my stock picks are in my other channel i'm gonna put the link on the bottom okay it's called money star traders so money star is one word that's that's gonna be my new last name money star and then traders that's one thing i'm changing my new my last name and everything new start yep new start but uh yeah, that, that's that's you know that that's you got you got to have a dream. You see, I have a dream. I have a plan. You see what I'm what I'm doing? In my mind, I'm 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 there. I live there. You feel me? This Jeep that I'm driving is a 1998 Jeep. I bought this Jeep at the auction maybe like eight years ago, seven eight years ago. I went there. Um. I did the whole watering system, everything, radiators, everything. Almost every part in this engine is new. Has it been replaced by me? But it's just temporary, you know. I even did the roof. You see that? Didn't have another that. I did all that, and I painted that thing black right there. <laughs> so yeah, it's you know, whatever, whatever. Whatever you want in life, just think about it, live it in your mind, and it will manifest. It will come. You got to be disciplined. You you know, uh, you, you just can't be doing, well, I'm doing it over here, but then over here, you're wasting your time. Yeah, I want to get rich, but now you're taking selfies and putting them on social media. Because for why? Who wants to see you? Really, let me tell you something. Is it that important for you to take pictures of yourself and put them on, 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 on Facebook and all those stupid platforms? Is, is that more important than, than studying and learning to trade stocks? I'm telling the easiest way to get rich is to learn to trade stocks. Okay? So, what's more important? You got you to gotta ask yourself that. What do you want? Discipline, discipline, discipline. So, to succeed in life, these are the steps you gotta you gotta apply. Remember, never try, never see yourself better than anybody else. Never try to compete with no one. 
Just be more disciplined than every person you meet. And don't tell nobody your plans. You tell your plan to a weak mind, and they always have an excuse that you're not even asking for them for their advice, but they got some stupid negative thing to tell you, to tell you that, well, oh, you crazy, you shouldn't do that. They like look look at look at um Jeff Bezos, the founder of um, Amazon, when he told his boss he was going to quit, and his boss took him on a big walk and please don't leave, and pretty much begging him don't leave. Jeff Bezos said, no, I'm going to sell I'm gonna sell books online. People are saying, you crazy. Ain't nobody going to buy no books online. Amazon, what is that? You crazy? You going crazy? Now he's the richest man in the world. Who's crazy now, baby? Exactly. You see? There's nothing impossible. Just what you tell yourself. This is Michael. Subscribe. Thanks for watching.